preparing for the check-in with your manager, usually I get a list of questions together. Um, I will also have my goals that I want to obtain for the year. Um, they usually have um, the hospital goals and then your own personal achievement goals. And then how I'm going to meet those goals. And then I'll ask her questions um, like how, how do I go about this? What can I do better in the unit? What are some learning opportunities or personal um, opportunities that I can grow in? Come prepared, bring notes, keep track of the things that you do throughout the quarter so that you can talk about them. Oftentimes there's little things that we have questions about or we feel that we did really well that a month later we don't remember. And if, if you keep a journal, even though we're doing check-ins now, in TalentLink you can still have the journal. And I use that a lot. I'll keep little journal snippets of, hey, I did this, it was really great. Or, you know, I dropped the ball and this is my plan to do better. A lot of people are happy with where they're at. Um, and some people aren't. And the check-in process is great because you'll have the opportunity to assess that. and. All the supervisors I've ever had within Intermountain Healthcare are very supportive of growth and they'll help you get where you want to be. So just be prepared. You'll get out of it what you put into it. If you show up for a check-in and you're not excited about it, you're not prepared, you want your supervisor to just run it and basically tell you whatever, it's going to be a five minute unproductive interview and probably be right along, sign, along lines as the annual review. It'll, it'll just be, nothing will change, so it's up to you.